Now, listen. This just makes it perfect. This just makes it perfect. We're behind. They're all fired up. Say to you that we got a class, we're going to find it out. So we got class, and I know we've got it. Now, what we got to do? First place, our defense has got to go out there and take the ball. Our defense hasn't been taking the ball. Then when we get the ball, we got to have 11 people. 11 people that's just going to do their job, whatever it is. It's going to do their job and try to score every time you get the football. If we do that, we'll be all right. If we do that, we'll be all right. The offensive team has started. The same team started on offense to start, except stable the quarterback. Okay, can we get together? All we need is just somebody that wants to do some leadership out there. Now we go. Come on, Ed. Tell him the leader. away, penalty flag down, Lamar Thomas has got it, Lamar Thomas is on his way down the sideline, George Teague is after him and runs him down, takes the ball, takes the ball away from him, Teague's got the ball. Saying is, is it a simultaneous catch? 
going across the back of DJ Hall. Boy, oh boy. Mm. That ball was so, thrown so poorly, everybody was going for the football. There were three people that had a chance for it, but it looks like DJ Hall has a simultaneous catch with Hefney. Jonathan Hefney, number 33. Stewart was over the back. Shocked. I thought I thought Alabama had a really good chance to win the football game because of their defense and Brody Coyle. I am shocked that it's this type of a score. Tell you what we don't need is the throat slashing gesture we just got from DJ Hall. Florida still has a lot to play for. Make no mistake. I mean they. Uh, Still have a game with LSU, a game with Georgia at the end of the month, who's undefeated right now in the SEC. Could be the...